you know, again, you know, this is a project that you got immediately sort of three red flags that have gone up. One red flag is, for whatever reasons, if this is such a great project, why didn't they come and announce it and start talking to people down here? If they're so proud of this industry and what it can bring to the county, there'll be positives, there'll be jobs, but this comes with other things that we'll, we'll see in a minute. Uh, why didn't they come, announce it, and say, let's have a conversation about it? The other red flag is they did this in Wilson, exactly the same thing. It showed up, they were gonna build it. Wilson said, not only said no, they opposed it, they filed lawsuits, and they beat it. They did not locate that facility in Wilson because the people didn't want it in that local community. And they, they ultimately prevailed. And the third red flag that's now gone up is that this, this doesn't affect this area, Cedar Creek or even Fayetteville. It affects the whole Cape Fear Basin all the way down to Wilmington. The excess nutrients that go into this river here make their way down, end up in that green bloom you saw above Lock and Dam number one, that's Wilmington's water intake. So this is a much bigger issue than just here and it's gonna be important for all of you, and we can help with this, and Kemp can help with this, Cape Fear Riverkeeper, and Larry can help with this, of getting others involved. 